B-Dog the Collect 24 here, and this is my top 10 figures of 2013 video. Um, this is just my opinion on the greatest figures of this year, so don't uh, put in the comments this figure wasn't good, that figure wasn't good, uh, this figure was 10 times better than something else, and just please don't do that, this is just my opinion, so let me get started at, top, at uh, number 10. Uh, basic 36 Big E Langston. Uh, I just think this was a well-constructed figure. Um, he has the new body mold. and uh, The only thing I think they could have done better on are the arms. Um, maybe Zeke arms would have looked better. But um, <clears throat> uh, he's still a pretty cool figure. Um good head scan and he's in scale so that's good uh, I know Mattel does scale stuff good but sometimes their scale is just a little off but I mean he's uh, perfectly in scale you know, he has his own boot mold and everything so that's pretty cool <clears throat> so that's number 10 just push him off to the side at number nine, uh, Toys R Us uh, exclusive Triple H. Um, this is, in my opinion, the best head scan for a Triple H figure. Uh, I know other people might have other opinions, but uh, I just think this uh, looks just like Triple H. Uh, and they've had some failed attempts for Triple H head scans in the past, but I think they nailed this one. He has the cloth shirt. <clears throat> And his WrestleMania trunks. Uh, it comes with a sledgehammer. Uh, and the good thing is, since they uh, messed with uh, ankle joints, he actually stands. Unlike every other Triple H figure with loose ankles, he actually stands. So that's that's awesome. <clears throat> Uh, the only thing I would have liked more is if he had the black wrist tape instead of the white, but that's just a simple fix-up, so I don't have a problem with that. Uh, if I feel like it's such a problem, I'll just get another one of the Curtis Axel Battle Packs and arm swap it, and it'll look just like uh, it would it would have if Mattel would have given him the black wrist tape, so... Uh, he's number nine. Awesome figure. I recommend if you don't have him, pick him up. <clears throat> uh, number eight, Elite 22 Damien Sandow. Uh, he has the cloth robe and the <clears throat> towel. Uh, I'm glad these are cloth instead of um, being rubber, especially the robe. Uh, he has the light pink knee pads or the light purple knee pads and the dark purple trunks <clears throat> they could have chose a better body mold for him though uh, I, I could be wrong but I think he shares the same body mold as Seamus so they could have chose a better body mold than that but <clears throat> not not too bad since I keep the robe on him anyway uh, still a really awesome figure. <clears throat> uh, I think these have been popping up in stores again. I, I could be wrong. I think people have uh, seen Fresh Case of Elite 22 recently. So if uh, you skipped out on him before and you get a chance to pick him up again, I highly recommend picking him up. He is a great figure and uh, obviously one of my favorites of this year. And this is going to be the last one, and I'm going to cut the video for now, and part two will be up soon. Next is the basic shield. I'm going to count these as one, uh, just for the fact that they're almost all the same. But um, good figures, uh, really, really good figures for the first. Um, first, so uh, the only thing, Roman Reigns doesn't have his tattoo sleeve, but... Uh, that's okay, but I mean really good figures. <clears throat>
Um, the head scan aren't too bad. They could have done better better on Seth. But uh, Dean and Roman are good. <clears throat> really like their head scans. Um, they all have their own vests. Um, and they're in scale. They could have done better on the pant mold. But they're fine for the, what they are. <clears throat> for being basics. Uh, I think Roman and Seth share the same pant mold. That, that's what I was getting at. They should have uh, given them their, all, their own unique pant mold. Cause I know Dean got his. But it's all good. <clears throat> um, so, yeah, there's number four. Basic shield. <clears throat> so that's it for now. Uh, stay tuned for part two, and I'll see you later. Bye.